Hey everybody, it's Manly Badass Hero, and welcome back to Knock Knock. Previously, we got all the diary pages, and after dealing with a bit of a doppelganger problem, we're nearing the final days of our stay in this house. This is not a dream. This is really your own actual home. I'm glad it took you this long to figure out that this is not just sleepwalking. I mean, you know, after the whole straight jacket men doppelganger thing, I think we would rule that out. house has all these extra rooms we've gained now. A lot of the drawings you see on the wall are something straight out of a psych ward. Purposely so, obviously. But they're very nice touches. If you don't see something, it doesn't mean it isn't there. Yeah, you get the same diary pages every day. So once you got the first set, I'm assuming it puts a flag on your file, so you don't need the gem again? At least I'm hoping that that's what happens. Slippers. It's a little detail, but our. <laughs> but our main character always wears slippers or something in the corner there. So you pretty much roll out him walking around with these footprints with these white paint. See if we can get our final fragments of realities. Yeah, 
And that was an interesting one. Pretty important in symbolism, I think. Okay, let's see how my house looks this time. Not too much different. We'll go this way first. This is one of those kind of in-between rooms. I haven't quite figured out what triggers sometimes a room spawns much faster. Could just be entirely random. Guests like those only come in the dark because the shadows eat through the walls of your home. So I should leave my lights on? Very conflicting. No idea what the hell happened there. I'm going back in. What are you, son of a bitch? Oh, it's just the bedroom again. I'm not sure where I just spawned. Oh, a teacup. Alright. We're gonna run into some problems, I see. Well, this part of the house is all restored anyway. Something's fucking with me. Where? What the? <laughs> God, what the fuck was that? It instantly killed me. I'll keep you there for now. If I get hit by something, I'll come back for you. Oh, something actually formed there this time. I think last time it had nothing.
the line in that bedroom. Uh, I should turn on the light. Yeah, excuse me. I suppose if I leave the lights on, they malfunction on their own. I don't really know if that's true or not. I have a little bit of rear room. Alright, let's purge these beasts. Freaky. Just slowly. They don't look, it can't hurt me. Yeah, no. I can't hide in that thing. Oh, that's very bad. Oh shit. Oh shit. God, I hate that thing. your health. I see you now. You don't see anything. I'm a ghost. Ah! This whole house is going to hell. I gotta shut these demons out. That's already formed up. No, 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 I want to do this, yeah. I see you now. That really fucked my brain. Again. Keeps a little more health. Or time. Oh, that's a tr neat trick. Okay. This is getting a bit out of hand. Disco ball room. Seems to put it on. I mean, something's in here, isn't it? Mm. 
It begins. It begins. With anything. I'm just a poor boy who wants to get out of here alive. This house is becoming a no man's land. <laughs> Let's play now. I had nowhere literally to hide. Right here. It's about the only place. I know I'm lonely, and I have no friends. So I resort to playing hide and seek by myself. Why? I hear you. It's not a very good hiding spot. <laughs> I wonder where he is. Is he here? Nah. I'm coming to seek you. Did you forget to hide? His voices are just getting more active every time. This is a new room. Play now. No, let's not play. I don't like playing. Oh, okay. Oh no. No, 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 no. Here's the number one. This comes the hand one. Can you spot me while I'm hiding? Are you sick? I can hear you shaking. This is not fun anymore. I'm completely pinned in. They got me like locked in this room pretty much. I want to see you. Where are you? Let's get out of here. I must Banish the darkness with the light. Praise the sun. I don't want to use you yet. I still got plenty of time health. They are coming. Nothing here. <laughs>
Okay. God. I haven't reformed the full house. Oh no. I see you. So I'm actually gonna like waste away some time so I can reform the other rooms over there because I think that's pretty important but I could be wrong. Why? Hi. Ow! <laughs> Okay, that's not an instant kill. They did hurt. It's enough where if you were less than, um... Hey, you. If you were only like a halfway health fire on there, which is not really halfway, um, it would probably just knock you instantly to wake up mode. I'm surprised this room doesn't form up. Probably later in the game. Alright. Let's reclaim. No, no. Why? Hi. He's just camping out. I'm tempted to go get myself hit just to get rid of him. Because I know he'll just spawn. He doesn't do that much damage. But, you know, it's just. <laughs> yeah, he hit me anyway. Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna skedaddle over here. And shit. Close the gates of oblivion. Ow, my brain. Moment health. Well, time health. Alright, let's reclaim the rest of the house. Don't be easy. Let's go downstairs. Here's another one of these rooms. You can have that part of the house. I'm done from that part. That door looks interesting. We're locked in. Doesn't look like we have a place to hide. be downstairs and not up. Freeze. Not sure where it is. No, 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 it's not the place I want to be. It's in the place I don't want it to be. Come on, unlock you, motherfucker. We're out of here. So long, farewell. Coming to seek you. Did you forget to hide? What is it doing? It doesn't shut off the lights. Is it waiting down there? I can't really tell. Oh, I see. It's going left. Why? Hi. Where is it now? <laughs> I was going to stick around to find out. It could very well just be down here and I wouldn't know.
I just gotta keep my eyes open and watch the handprint thing going on. I'm gonna meet you. It's literally spawned down there. And it almost instant hit me with how close it spawned me, but I didn't react fast enough. This is the last room I gotta reform. You are missing the point. Go into the eye, they said. It'll be fun, they said. This is how to play the game. They are only visible in the dark. First, you turn off the light in your home, and open all the doors. As soon as one of your doors slams shut, close your eyes and say, I'm glad to see you. Thank you for coming. If you did everything correctly, for a second, you will see a fully set table with a round loaf of bread in the center. At the table, there will be people staring back at you. Remember their faces. Recall their voices. These are the invisible that you brought to live in your home. I think I've done something like that in the past. I don't like that giant ominous monster thing right there next to my home. Okay. I guess I'm on this set for the bad end. I feel like there's some kind of giant monster out there. Badly badass hero. I'm controlling your actions and sending you down the wrong path. Come out. It's time.
Don't look in the mirror. Look out the window. What you're seeing isn't really nothing. He's really going mad now. Guests almost never kill. They only bring you back. Because... Because you haven't finished yet. That's different. Things sure have changed, haven't they? What was once a nice forest is now a hellhole. All because I didn't follow the damn train. Too late. My fate is sealed. And that's all for part three. I believe in some of the lodgers madness and dialogue, there are some implications that the person who wrote the diary could have been his father. And uh, 
I'll get into that more later as uh, I finish the game. But there is a possibility that I have a little kind of crack theory in my head that I'm developing now. And also, while it seems like we're locked into the bad end, I did some reading and I apparently... Um, the developers did say that you can still get the good ending, even if it looks like you're about to get the bad end. And I think it's just a matter of grabbing as many fragments of reality at the last minute as you can, and doing some other things. So, seeing the monster in the back does not necessarily mean you're going for the bad end, it just means you probably are. Either way, we'll just roll the punches and we'll see what happens. And if I get the bad end, I'll just replay the game and get the good end real quick. Also, this is actually a question posed to my viewers. Have you been able to find multiple reality fragments in one forest run? And that's my question. Because after finding the first one, I have never been able to find the girl again. I will literally wander for almost, probably about 40 minutes, and I will not find her. Going up, down, left, right, and I would just keep finding the house. So I was wondering if you could only find her once in the forest every turn, or if it just maybe lowers the chances once you find her the first time. Because it seems the house appearing started taking a higher percentage chance, but that could just be all my head, and it could just be unlucky. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and stay tuned for part four.